No hitting. Today we had no staging to do, so we had nothing to put up or nothing to decorate, nothing to take down. So we decided since we were all home together as a family, we would come up with something fun to do for the kids since we're getting close to Halloween. And we thought, let's go hunt for ghosts. Um, or do some paranormal, paranormal hunting. I know what we should do today. What? Go antiquing. Go to the antique shop. Okay. Daisy, you want to go to the um, the little antique shop over there? Yeah. Well, it's haunted. Do it. It's supposedly haunted. We'll bring the. We'll do the ghost app. Uh, we'll do the little ghost tracking. No, you gotta get the app. No, the ghost. Stop it, you guys! Like, the ghost app. Stop it! You're making yeah, yeah. it even scary, y'all. So I can't go. Actually, I don't think kids are allowed in there. You have to be 13 and over. Just in case. Anything. How about we go somewhere else? Go somewhere else later, but antique shop first. No. Yes, because we have me No, and... I, I'm going to go fast because I'm the princess. You want to do the ghost tracking like we're going to do? How about I go somewhere else? You can't later. There. Yes, later. Later. You all have to go to different stuff so I can go there. But we have priorities and we have to do ghost hunting first. Morning ghost hunting, then fun later. No, fly right now. My wife Jessica decided that it would be a great idea to take the kids ghost hunting at a local uh, shop. It's an antique shop. It's been around forever. And this place is located in Old Town Cordelia. The place is actually named after a man's wife who owned the whole area uh, about 125, 150 years ago. And so we decided to go to this antique shop. And when we entered the antique shop, you can feel very a uh, chilled feeling, okay? And when you go inside, there's a bunch of old stuff everywhere, obviously. It's an antique shop, right? Welcome to Virginia Johnson. Well, a funnel. Oh, that's okay. Keep your hands on the I'm gonna try one of the trees. Oh, I, I have to get over to this area. A donkey! I'll show you guys. My donkey! Look at that old typewriter. Right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now I'm actually getting scared. You really can go in here, Mom? No, no, no. 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 I think there's an off It says keep the hell out. It says keep the hell out. Start vibrating. Start vibrating. Okay, go, go, go. It's recording all this so I can check all the levels too late. Okay, Um, I want to go in this area right here, but without the kids. Go over here. Go Whoa. over here. You guys, can you okay. take them? Go on, you guys.
still vibrating right here. Okay. I'm not gonna go any farther over there. Jessica had a, uh, a, a, a meter that can actually read the energy levels uh, of ghosts. It's spiked. And she flipped out. Because I don't know if she really believed in ghosts as much as what I have. But now I think she's a true believer. Mommy! Shh. Pick him up. Yeah. Yeah. We're at 130,000. 130, In the car, this is only at, like 15,000. All these numbers were super low. Now look. Up, 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 up. <laughs> Those were all low. Staying. Staying up there. See? It's all up. It's all peaking right here. See, it was, it was low, and now it's up. No matter what I do, it's staying up. <laughs> it's still up. It's still not going up. The only thing I can come up with was download an app where you can, like, detect the energy, which is, I believe it's called, I think it's, like, EMF detection or something, which is basically measuring the energy in the room. Is that green? At the bottom? That just went up. That's what went up. Yeah. So, let's go to the next area. That's enough for me in that area. I don't want to experience anything strange. At first, it was super low and it didn't detect anything. But as soon as we started going into the different little coves and areas inside of the antique shop, there were literally like levels going off, going up to high levels on the detector. So apparently there was some sort of spirit or energy we were measuring and it was actually obvious on our app. Uh, there's a lot of like unique and good stuff and to find. And the old stuff lasts longer than the new stuff. It de well obviously it's already lasting. Yeah, yeah, you buy furniture last you five years from the store, oh, buy this gosh. old stuff, it's yeah. over a hundred years old and it's still working. Yeah, I know. Anyway, so it starts going off the chart and basically it's like measuring some sort of energy. The energy of what it is, I don't know, but I believe it's probably pretty correct because it only went off in certain areas which were like the areas you kind of feel yourself just to, you know, your own feeling tells you there's something there. So since it matched my own feeling, I believe it was real. So when we decided to start looking for ghosts inside of our own home, you know, my daughter Aqua got really scared. She started crying and she started screaming my name and she didn't really want to be involved in it. So we had to kind of tell her, hey, ghosts are fake. And that kind of helped her cope with it. Uh, I kind of realized now she's a little bit too young to uh, learn about what ghosts truly are and how ghosts work because a lot of people think ghosts are just bad things and she can't differentiate between good ghosts and bad ghosts. So. I'm wondering which one's most sensitive. I need to know which detector is most sensitive. Hmm. What does this one look? How do I see? I want to see it. See the glass? Ghost hunting detector. EMF detector. The interrogator, vibration detector, power detector, and EVP recorder. Oh, sh you scared Dad, Dad. me, Boosh. Cat, Dad. Like a real one? I don't know. That's why I'm gonna try it. Well, I want. I'd rather there's measure no, the energy. There's no, there's no such thing as a ghost. That's true. Ghosts are big.
It's so loud. How big? Watch out. I don't know when it's going to make a loud noise once it gets high. That's what I'm worried about. It's taking forever to download. That would be crazy. It's probably because it's real. So the one that costs, do you think that's probably the realest one? The one you got to pay for? Well, that's what I was looking at is um, if I can just measure it. I'd rather just measure it than see a vision. Yes, no. I want to have an actual measurement. Wait, what? Oh, oh, oh. It's, not it's not detecting anything. Vision is just so high. Uh, Mom, we have to ghost detect the stairs. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, no. It's okay. It's not scary. Daddy, you got it. Huh? No, no, no. The cat's going to help us. Okay, listen up. This is, we're gonna, this is what we're going to do. Okay. We're going to go up. We're going to do this upstairs, and we're going to see if we can find any energy or yeah. mm -hmm. ghost well. energy. And we're going to use this to measure out the, I guess it's EV, EVF. Energy? I don't know. Let's yeah. just see if it works. Turn off the lights though first. You have to have all lights off because yeah. the energy will disturb any, um, or the lights will disturb okay. any energy. So get the lights off and we'll go up. Yeah, make them here. It's come okay. here. The cat will come with us. The cat will come. Come on, hurry. Hurry. How? I want to check something. Okay, Daisy, get over here. Hurry. How do you know? Oh, this I saw it like far away. Oh, you're you're playing with me. It's probably Gambit. It's okay. Did you just look like I just saw Gambit. Come on. That's in the marble. I guess not. Oh my god. <laughs> it's actually going up and down. So when he's very high at red, then. This is where we always see stuff, so this is probably like this area. Uh -huh. I don't know if I'm supposed to hold it up or down. Like, where the hell are ghosts? Where do they stand? Up in the corner? There's a little away. Do they hide down? Yeah, so no, not this far. Or how about off the stairs? This is where we always see shit, so. Right. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. I know where. I know where. Oh, this is stupid, baby. Dad, come on. I think that I'm the only one in my family who actually truly, truly believe in ghosts. Okay? And I'm gonna to explain to you why. When I was just a little boy, I was about three, three or four, and I lived in this town. It was called Woodland, California. Okay, if you Google that or whatever you do, it'll show all the old houses. Well, we lived in one of those houses. And one early morning, I was laying between my mom and dad. Okay, the sun had just risen. And a ghost was going through a wall over and over, a pink ghost, a silhouette going through the wall over and over and over, and I was numb, I couldn't actually move, but I wasn't afraid. And I think the ghost was trying to make me laugh, like it was doing some kind of peekaboo thing. And that's just one experience that I have with ghosts, that is true, and I have many more. I always feel nauseous in the laundry room. In the laundry room? But I always okay. think it's a washer. Okay, come on, let's go see. Turn it on. Wait, hold on. Yes. No, turn off. Turn it off. Oh my gosh, it is going up. It is? No! Mom! No, stop, 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 stop. Boucha, stop. Boucha, go. Over there with the kitty. Go with the kitty. No, I can't. It did go up. Back here. Look how low it is. So shiny.
I won't be coming in here at night wait, anymore. Wait, wait, wait. Dad, I'm going to pass out right now. Come on. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's, it's a wall, though. I don't get it. It's a wall. Well, Deja, what is a wall for a ghost? It's a wall. It's a wall. Booge, look. Let me go oh run it away. I don't know. Where are you going? There we go. laughing in the back. You know what? I can do this on my own. Okay? I think that I'm... <clears throat> Motherfucker. <clears throat> Motherfucker! Okay. I think that I'm the only one in my family who actually truly, truly believe in ghosts. Okay. Um... You can't do that. You cannot be clicking pictures while while I'm recording. Okay, what, what no, I'm serious. Okay, you can't do that shit. Beautiful. Quit hating on me, man. I think he looks beautiful right now. Thanks. Look. Jay, I gotta I gotta I finish really, my job. You look like a newscaster. Oh my gosh. Okay, Jesus Christ, I look like a newscaster. <laughs> yes, I do. So today, my wife Jessica thought it was. So today, my wife. See, you can't do that, Jay. Stop. I knew you messed up. Yes, sir. How much time I got on that clock? What's up, Jay-Z? How much time I got on that clock? Six minutes. So, yeah. So, yeah. I got a list of people that I want to talk to. A list of people I want to do deals with. It's pistachios. You know. Got it? Yeah. Uh-huh. Get at us. You know who we are. Get at us because we all the way up. 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 And we ain't coming down. So eventually, you're going to have to see us. Because we're rolling in the same circle. So get at us. Get at us. We rising to the top. Can't nobody stop us. We got the keys, the keys, the keys. So it candles. Yes. But what is that going into in this episode? What? How's that going to fit into the episode? So my wife makes natural... Flake free soy candles with a wooden wick. And she's already making the Christmas scents, winter scents, even fall scents she already has prepared. Now you need to go get yourself some candles. Gold Hill Candle Co., you need to go get some candles. Natural soy flake free wood wick candles. And they smell delicious. You have to. To order some and if you don't you're missing out I'm just saying I'm just saying get with the program go buy some candles now I promise you you won't regret it I promise you
So when I was five years old, I got pushed into a pool. I drowned. I was under there for four or five minutes. The story goes, my cousin dives into the water and he picks me up out of the, from the very bottom. I, was, I remember swallowing water as if it was air. I don't remember struggling. I don't remember any of it. But I do remember some blur of something diving in and pulling me up. My cousin who saved me said, you were completely gone and your eyes were rolling behind your head. He pumped my stomach, a lot of water flew out of my mouth. Ever since then, I've had this ability to read minds and see ghost. <coughs> Sounds crazy, but it's true. Come on, come right here. Come on, come in here. Come right here. We only got I'm, I'm stuck. No, actually, keep talking, go ahead. So, uh, together, we decided to let the kids experience paranorm paranormal activity. Together, we decided to let the kids experience paranormal activity. Mm. We're ghost testing. We're, we're ghost. fucked right now, vocally. <laughs> Let's start this shit over. Yes. Fuck because that. The ghosts do okay. that, too. Okay, here we go, here we go. So, Hold on, wait. I think it's done. No, it's not. I got two minutes. Two minutes ago, you had two minutes. You have 20 seconds. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Get over here. Don't stop it. Okay, 20 seconds left. Okay, we, we enjoyed searching for ghosts yeah. on my son's birthday. Never doing it again.